Hello friends, welcome to the world of maths by Ami again. We are discussing CAT 2006 actual question. This is one of the toughest question of the CAT 2006. Why I am saying that one of the toughest question because many students didn't attempt this question. But this is not the toughest but conceptual. The question is in front of you. I would say please read the question. According to question, we have a square of length 2 unit. So we can say the square of length 2 unit. And we have a circle of diameter 2 unit. Fine. And this is nothing but punching machine. The most important thing is what? The diameter of the hole originating at P is in the line with the diagonal of the square. So we have this line as a, a diagonal of the square. And our center of this circle also lies on the diagonal. So assume this one is the center. If we join these two points, this would be nothing but diameter. How comes they pass from the centers? Because this figure is nothing but a similar figure because our center and a diagonal are in the same line. So this should be, must be diameter. We can say this one is nothing but 45 degree. This one is nothing but 45 degree. Total angle is 90 degree. So this must be a diameter from the second point of reference. How come? Because only diameter makes angle 90 degree. And we know the diameter is nothing but of the two units. So what it means? The radius should be one unit. So this one is one unit. And if we join these lines, we get nothing but again a square. So we have say the P, Q, R and S is nothing but a new small square. And we have two questions. Proportion of the seats that remains after punching means we are looking for the area of this part. And the question will find the area of the part of the circle falling outside means we are looking for the area of this part. We have a center. We have 45 degree. We have radius. So we can say this one is nothing but again a 45 degree. This angle is nothing but 90 degree. So we have to find the area of the sector. If you are looking for this angle, the area of the sector is what theta upon 360 into pi r square is the total area and looking for the area of this arc is nothing but the area of triangle that is nothing but half into base into height is nothing but radius square how comes because these two are the radius at 90 degrees so we can apply the right angle triangle formula half into base square so our area r theta is nothing but 90 degrees so we can say 90 upon 360 into pi and radius is 1 minus 1 by 2. So this is nothing but by 4. So our this area is nothing but pi by 4 minus 1 by 2. So we can say this area should also be pi by 4 minus 1 by 2. So the answer of question number 2, find the area of the part that circles falling outside is nothing but pi by 4 minus 1 by 2 plus pi by 4 minus 1 by 2 is the summation of both. That is nothing but pi by 4 minus 1 by 2 into 2. So this becomes pi by 2 minus 1. So this is the area which fall outside of the our aluminium seat. So the answer of this one is what? Pi minus 2 divided by 2. So the answer is nothing but option number 4. I hope this one is clear. Now we need to solve question number 1. Let's solve question number 1 in a new page. We have to find out the proportion. What do you mean by the proportion? The proportion means what? the required out of total the required is what the remaining after punching we require is the remaining area i hope this one is clear according to question and out of total seat is the ratio we are looking for so the remaining area out of total seat area is the proportion word we know the length of a square is nothing but two so the total area is nothing but four because it's a square seat and we just calculated the area of this square half into diameter into diameter is what we have calculated. The area is nothing but the 2. So we have to remove this part. We have also removed this part because it is the part of the punching machine. And we have just calculated in the question number 2. The area of these two is nothing but pi by 2 minus 1. So the total area which is covered by the punching machine is nothing but 2 plus pi by 2 plus 1 is nothing but pi by 2 that is minus 1 is nothing but pi by 2 plus 1 so this is the area which is covered by the punching machine so the area which is not covered by the punching machine is the 
area of the square or we can say the remaining area is the 4 minus area which is covered by the punching machine. So this value is nothing but 3 minus pi by 2 or we can say that is nothing but 6 minus pi by 2. So the remaining area is 6 minus pi by 2. So the proportion of the C that remains is nothing but 6 minus pi divided by 8. So our answer is nothing but 6 minus pi divided by 8 is option number 2. We need to find the proportion and we solve the question. Okay, I hope this one is clear. This is one of the best question of menstruation with lot of basic concept. Right angle 90 degree, diameter and the dial and the area of sector. Still if you have any doubt, feel free to bring me. Okay, thank you and happy learning.